Good morning. It's Friday, December 4th, and it's time for writing. So today is a huge day because we're going to be writing sentences. So what you'll need today, you have your writing paper. You'll see on the top, copy, there is a sheet that has the two sentences we'll be writing. Underneath is the paper that you're going to use to write on. This is just for you to reference and look at, but the one on the bottom is the one that you're going to write on. For this, you will need your pencil, you will need your spaceman, and you'll need your eraser. We always make a few mistakes. That's how we learn, so we don't want to not give ourselves the opportunity to learn. So keep that eraser so that we can correct any mistakes we make. So let's talk about what makes up a sentence before we start writing. We've talked about this a little bit. We know that every sentence starts with a capital letter. So the first letter and the word that starts each sentence should always be an uppercase letter. And we also know it's a sentence when it has a period at the end to stop our words from falling off the page. We've talked about this. All right, so we're going to read the two sentences that we're going to be writing today. And then this is what I want you to do. When we go to write them, you're going to do it with me. We're going to do it step by step. But we are going to sound out and spell each word and not just copy it. So let's read our first sentence. D-ad. Dad, side word, is sad. 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 All right, let's go back and read that a little quicker. Dad is sad. And remember, a hand signal for a period at the end. All right, so watch me read it. Dad is sad. That's our first sentence. Our next sentence is d a l Doll, remember two L's, but only one sound. D all doll, sight word is g l ad, glad. Doll is glad, so watch me read that. Doll is glad. Make sure you get that period. It stops the words and keeps them from falling off the page. We make the period just like we make the dot on an I. So you remember I taught you to put your hand down, rest it on the paper, put your writing instrument on the paper, and just wiggle it a little bit to make a teeny tiny dot. We don't make a circle with our hand or draw what we call the lollipop. Remember how we would color it in? If you rest your hand on the page, put your writing instrument down, and just wiggle it a little bit, you'll just get that teeny tiny dot, and the period looks just like the dot above the eye. It sits on the green line at the end of the word, in the last word in your sentence, okay? So we're going to do this step by step together. So I want you to start with your blank sheet of paper. I'm going to be using an Expo marker just so that you can see, or actually a Sharpie, just so you can see my writing. You will be using a pencil. As you know, at the stop sign, we always write their, your name. So I'm going to put my name at the stop sign real quick, making sure form all my letters correctly, starting at the two o'clock dot. I got my name on there. You should be putting your name beside the stop sign. Okay, there's my name right beside the stop sign. I'm just this so you can see it a little bit better. And you may pause this if you've not finished writing your name, but go ahead and write your name. All right, there's my name. I'm coming down to my next row of start right lines. Red, green, yellow. Okay, my first word was dad. Let's sound it out. D, A, D. What's our first sound? D, D. Has to be an uppercase letter because we're starting a sentence. So we're going to write D, D, uppercase. Am I going to space? No, because we don't space in between letters in a word. It is word, space, word, space. D, A, A. Red hot vowel, A. Final sound, D. It's another D, but it's lowercase, so we're going to do two o'clock dot, up to the red, down to the green. Sight word is, we worked with this uh, in morning work and also in, in the letter book writing sentences, is, is I, S. We don't want to sound that word out. We want to just read it. We want to memorize it. So we have, so far we have dad, is. All right, we put space in between dad and is. There's our space. 
end of his, we need another space. He was sad. S -s sad. Let's type out that word. S -a -d. What's the first sound? S, -s. We're going to put S right there. Now we can remove our space man because we have our space. A. Red hot vowel A. D. D. Make the donut first and you will make D correctly. Go up to the red, down to the green. Uh-oh! Our sentence is going to fall off the page if we do not add our little period. So rest your hand and make the dot. Let's go back and read our sentence. Dad is sad. Okay, move down to the next start right line. Our next sentence is doll is glad. D, d, doll. D, ah, uppercase letter. We're starting a sentence. Capital D, d. O, ah, ah, red hot letter. Oh, oh, there's that dark L. Oh, but wait a minute. F, L, S, and Z. You double if a short vowel you see, and we see short vowel ah, so we need two L's. Doll. Red to green. Doll. Two letters, but only one sound. All right, what do we need next? We have a word. We need space. And our sight word is is. I, S. Do you remember what doll was? Doll is glad. She is glad. G, G. Got to need our space, man. G, G, O, dark L, red to green. A, A, what's our vowel? A, red hot letter. A, D, D. Two o'clock dot, do the donut first, red to green. And we don't want that to fall off the page, so we're going to put A period. <coughs> okay, excuse me. <clears throat> All right, now we're going to go back and read our sentences and make sure we have them correctly. I have my name at the top beside the start right sign. Duh, ad. Dad is sad. Sad. Dad is sad. Duh, all, l, doll is glad. Glad. Doll is glad. Give yourselves a golf clap. We're writing two complete sentences for the first time. If you would like to illustrate over here, you certainly can. You can draw a picture of your dad being sad, and you can draw a picture of doll being glad. Do not write on your great words, though. Make sure that you formed every letter correctly. If you did not, please go back and erase and make sure that you formed it correctly. I want really great handwriting. I know you're capable of that. All right. Have a great Friday.